Hey everyone, this is Brands Movie Corner and it's time for a VHS and Blu-ray update for August 7th, 2020. And I have four VHS tapes and one Blu-ray to show, which the four VHSs I ordered from eBay and the Blu-ray I ordered from BarnesandNoble.com last week and I've received them all over the past several days. Um, and I'm going to show them off right now and I'm going to start with the four VHS tapes which I got all of these from eBay. This first one came in on Monday, August 3rd, and it was brand new sealed. This is a better condition copy of the 1993 VHS of Death Becomes Her. And the reason why I got another copy is because this copy right here that I got back in April 2016 at a yard sale This copy has some mold on it, as you can see right here. It was a former rental from West Coast Video, and it was printed in the 53rd week of Nice Night 2. Sorry if you can't see it clearly, but yeah, this is the original print. And because this copy is moldy, I ordered another copy on eBay, which was brand new sealed. The cover looks exactly the same. Here's the tape with the sticker label. And this time, no end label because this is a later reprint. But you can see a day and year print date right here, which is the 54th day of Night Size 7. And it was printed in the 12th week of Night Size 7. So this is a later reprint. And because it was brand new sealed, this copy is in much better condition. So I'm going to keep this copy. And as for this one, I'm going to throw it out. Now this next tape came in on Saturday, August 1st. This is directed by the late Joel Schumacher who passed away back in June. So may he rest in peace. And this tape is white and it has a black ink label. So this is the Hollywood video version. And this is my first um, Hollywood Video 20th Century Fox tape that I have. I do have a few um, blockbuster um, 20th Century Fox tapes from this era that are blue, but this is the first Hollywood Video one I have, which is white. The print date is June 3rd, 2003. You may or may not be able to see it. And if you look closely in the printings, it says Hollywood. You might be able to see it now. It says Hollywood and the printing is right above where the print date is. So you can tell this is the Hollywood video copy. All right, this next tape came, um, I think it came on Tuesday, August 4th. But if I got it wrong, I'll correct myself in the description. July 19th, 1994, even though this is a 1993 VHS. And the last VHS, this one came in on Monday, and this is a pretty rare tape. My cat Alexa just meowed. From what I found out, this is the only Wild Thornberries VHS other than the movie to be released by Paramount. And this was a former owner for Movie Gallery in Verona, Wisconsin. And from what I found out, this tape was actually a Toys R Us exclusive. And I guess maybe this was purchased at Toys R Us and maybe it ended up at a movie gallery or something. I don't know. Put in the 39th week of 2000. And this is one of the last Paramount Nickelodeon tapes to be in EP mode. And before I show off the one Blu-ray, I'm going to let Alexa out of the room. All right.
right. Now for the one Blu-ray that I got from BarnesandNoble.com, and this one came in today. And this is another Criterion Collection Blu-ray. And I ordered this last Friday, July 31st, and the 50% the fifty percent off Criterion sale ended on Sunday, August 2nd. And this is actually a Netflix movie. And I did see this movie on Netflix back in February, and this was a really good movie. And it was one of two Netflix original movies to be nominated for Best Picture at the Oscars. The other one being The Irishman, which that one I saw on Netflix back in January, and that was a great movie. And speaking of which, I hear that the Criterion Collection is planning to release it on Blu-ray and DVD, even though the release date hasn't been announced yet. But whenever it does come out, I will definitely get it. I'll show this booklet in a second, but here's the disc. And underneath, there's inside artwork. I'm going to show this booklet quickly. And it comes with these um, two inserts that look like handwritten notes. I'm going to show them. And here's the other one. get this back in and that's going to do it for this vhs and blu-ray update for august 7th 2020 this is brand's movie corner signing off